Hi guys, it's Bales. Today we're gonna be reviewing the hottest torts in their TV spin from February. So jumping right into it, mesothelioma remains in our number one spot with a significant increase from last month's report at $4 million spent on TV. Camp Lejeune is still in our number two spot, also with increased spending compared to January data, while Chemical Hair Straightener jumped to our third spot for hottest tort. We're looking at a million dollar difference between January and February's data in regards to those hair products. It is important to note that there's a lot of new circulating around this tort. I myself find the discovery phase of these cosmetic lawsuits to be super interesting. Another thing to note is that as more people start to get in the game, the price of leads will likely be driven up, but we're still bringing in really great CPLs on all of our campaigns, and it's not too late to get your foot in the door. We do have a new tort making its first appearance on our report at number 10. We don't know much about this tort as it stands, but we're referring to this as 9-11 for the time being. This lawsuit targets first responders, other aides, and inhabitants that were located in Lower Manhattan up to a year after the World Trade Center attacks and were diagnosed with a list of applicable cancers due to toxic dust and or asbestos exposure. These payouts will be coming from the extension of the Victims' Compensation Fund or VCF, which was originally created in the early aughts, but we'll be sure to keep you guys in the loop as more develops. Remember, you can always look at our website for a quick update on what we're seeing across current campaigns, but if you'd like to get into the nitty gritty on the charts that we highlighted in this report or any others that weren't mentioned, don't hesitate to reach out with your criteria and I'll get you a custom quote.